Best brawler to win in solo showdown Scotch Stone Cold Edition, let's go! So basically for the newcomers, hi, I'm Great Echo Live and I record Brawl Stars content every day and occasionally some Clash Royale content. So um, basically in the Cold Edition, I'm gonna show you guys how I use Cold uh, for 3 rounds uh, at least and show you guys how I win with it. So the objective for the newcomers, um, I'm not trying to get number 1 or top 3, I'm just trying to get into the top 5 and later on I'm gonna build uh, my plan after that so um, if you can't even get into the top three I mean if you can't even get into the top five don't think about getting into the top three as that is just that would be a mess so um, we're in the top six right now want to get into the top five there we go as we are speaking so um, that's a hurt Daryl right here hopefully I can get him out right here there we go so I'm just gonna move out the way as Tick is just really really painful for some reason he just spams and just get a Aerie Splash damage and I'm in the top 4 right now let's go find Tick right here there we go so for Tick what you need to do is to keep on moving just keep on moving and that's what Colt needs to do as well so now um, Brock versus Colt hopefully we can win it hopefully so we have conquered the center right here and what we need to do is to wait for Brock to come near cause the poison won't wait for you whether you are a Brock, whether you are Nita, whatever they won't care about you, the poison is gonna get nearer and nearer so um, it's best if you could just stay out of the poison and there is a bad example for Brock I'm just gonna stay and heal oh my god his power up is just so overpowered guys so overpowered but at least I've got rank number two and had a competitive round which is great so if you guys want to play a uh, code actively this is how you play it and if you guys are into other brawlers, I've recorded three videos on this same map. One is for Shelly, another one is for Nita, and the last one would be for Edgar. And just search for the keyword Scotch Stone on my channel and you'll get a bunch of videos about this uh, map. So, um, yeah, basically second round, let's see how we go. And most importantly for code, you need to be accurate for like example Edgar, it doesn't need to be accurate for every shot cause Edgar is a short range brawler so whatever you do as long as you get the volumes in like Max Holloway, you get a few hundred punches, you would get at least two to three hundred on target so that would be nice and um after I get into the top 5, I'm going to move towards the center and yeah, I'm just gonna do this. There we go guys. So that's why I talk that's what I'm talking about. Just stay accurate and just aim properly and find the right opportunity to capitalize on your opportunity. So I've gone into the top six, got one kill. Quite a good result I would say. Go into the top four right away and I'm um, just gonna chill. Um Oh my god, that skin is so cool, but um, basically I'm gonna slowly move towards the center and maybe do this. Oh my god, I missed every single shot on my ultimate power. That's embarrassing, but it's still fine. I've still managed to go into the top 3 which is nice. So um, power up 5, surprisingly so. Okay, I'm gonna use my side feature right here to at least block out the pathway for him to run and we're gonna go here move towards the center oh my god power up 10 his power up 10 guys so not sure if I can finish this okay I'm getting wrecked but it's still fine we have got We've still managed to get top 2 right here which is just unbelievable So um, as I said my objective all along is to get into the top 5 don't, don't be too hard on yourself if you get like top 6 that might happen So um Yup let's go So
Oh my god, I'm just gonna run. Oh my god. I'm just getting wrecked in this round. So I'm just gonna try once again. Okay, final round, let's go. So normally, uh, as I said, I'm gonna record at least three gameplays. So even if I lose, that's a learning, um, that's a learning way of learning for you guys. So I'm um, just gonna do this. Oh my god, I just missed that shot completely. Okay, with the help of Nita, we have got one power up. Okay, there's another power up box right here. So I'm gonna get this one right here. And again, be accurate. Try to be accurate in every single shot, including your sight feature, the penetrating shot. Make sure to be accurate at all times. So I'm just gonna do this. Okay, so just take the uh, just take the block as a uh, an aiming subject. Okay, to dodge the missile, cause Brock's missile isn't a joke. So, okay, let me try this. Okay, I'm in the top five right now. I think Brock isn't gonna come any nearer because he has, uh, he has conceded more shots than me. So, into the top four right now. Into the top three right now. Oh my god, did I just kill Brock as he went into the poison? I'm not sure. Okay, he did. So, um, I'm just gonna escape from Nita right here because Nita is a mid-range brawler, so he won't come any nearer. As I'm gonna just break him from a distance, so yep. Um, if you guys check out my Nita gameplay, you would see that I play more passively, uh, as it is really, really dangerous to play it in another way, which is playing really, really actively and not getting any kills, which is not that efficient. So I'm just gonna wreck the Nita from this diagonal. Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna get wrecked soon. He's being invisible for a minute. I'm gonna get top 2, which I'm really really happy about as this guy's 8 power up or something like that. But at least I've got a few couple uh, trophies up here and just get a really really good, um, really really good and smooth trophy road climbing right here. So basically, this will be the video guys. Comment down below what the other brawlers you are using in Solo Showdown Scotch Stone and also subscribe for similar content like this. And I'm gonna see you guys in my next video. Peace out.